Okay, so it's been about a week since um, the last bug video that I put out. Um, and I'm just going to be talking about today um, that Roblox is on their Roblox Studio is on a real fast decline. Um, I'm starting to think they're in their final days because this right here, none of results found. This issue is still happening after like how many months now? This is happening again. Oh, and one other thing that I've been trying to do for the past two weeks. I'm trying to save a model. The overwrite and existing asset is back, but it they limited you even more to how much you can overwrite to. And that little tip slash trick that I showed y'all how to do, you can't do it anymore. So when I go to open Rails Unlimited, go back to me, I can wait five whole minutes and it's just going to be like this. In fact, this is even bugged right here. Overwrite an existing asset. It should, if I, I'm at this screen, it should say save as a new model, not overwrite an existing asset because I am. Yeah, I can't access that. Two bugs in one video. And they just updated Studio. Yet, I don't know why they updated it if it didn't do anything. It has been about three or four months since this whole new asset configurator was added. And here's a little lesson to all of you. If something is not broken, don't replace it. But the people behind studio are ignorant and they decide to update it anyways and be like, oh, this is going to be real good. This is going to help people a lot. But the fact that I'm seeing multiple bugs with this, not only with this, but the new toolbox in general, it's, it's crazy. Like they... I can't, it doesn't give us a feature to downgrade either. You can't do that. So, yeah. I think Roblox Studio is nearing its final days. Um, until people are just going to completely quit using it. And just, people are, and without Studio, people can't make games. And without games... People can't play Roblox. So, I'm also a little bit more calm today because I haven't been uh, working on as much stuff recently. Um, that's probably a good thing because it takes up a lot of my time. But yeah, I cannot save a single thing. If I want to save this, um, these this trains thing I cannot do it override an existing asset so it goes back to this again but if I hit it shouldn't be doing this it shouldn't say this while I'm at this screen it, it they're just breaking this so much that it's gonna be a useless feature. It already is a useless feature. <clears throat> What's the point of overriding a model if you can only see six 
12 of your assets. It went back to doing this again. And if I try to go to my other groups, come back, I can wait and wait and wait and it doesn't respond at all. Way to, way to go Roblox, again, again. Twice in one month, you idiots screwed up studio more and more. First, you removed the entire overwrite models option. And now, you give it to us back, but it's bugged. And you, you still can't access your full amount of models. Why did they do this? Are they just so ignorant and stupid that they have to piss all of us off with these stupid new features that don't even work? Now, the issue to fix the toolbox not showing up, this is fixed. All you do is load it up to there. But watch, you're probably going to update that to where it doesn't do anything and you have to close the whole program just to get your models to load. I could look. Look, there it goes again. No models found. There, now my models are showing up. Recent models, my models. If I just go back and forth like this every now and again, it's just going to it's going to break like if I look up. Or if I search up things Gore, whatever gore is, I don't know. I can do a whole bunch of stuff. It's deciding to work right now. But if I kept going back and forth like that after a while, it just bugs out. Let me fluctuate images, meshes, audio. Yeah, I want to uh, also anyone who is curious about my uh, train collection that I'm going to be adding. There is a um, a Norfolk Southern vintage locomotive pack I'm going to be releasing um, if they fix these issues because I cannot, I just cannot. Um, work around these problems they're everywhere like you can't do anything so I'm just gonna go over what locomotives I have so far so we have this Norfolk Southern S or X Southern um, high hood GP 38-2 5150 um, it has the old style lettering or old style font that they use for the numbering um, it's got the bell up there. These are my favorite type of high hoods, the real old ones. Um, <clears throat> I know this is still unrealistic. Norfolk Southern high hood GP38s. I don't think any of them have the horse head scheme. I think it's all just the real old um, stripes. But I can't find access to that yet. Uh, Norfolk Southern GE... T40-8, 8680, um, again with the black face. I'm going to keep going with the black face um, cabs because um, back before the 90s and all that, they were all um, black face. So here is a real old one that I love. This is my favorite Norfolk Southern GE locomotive is a C39-8 um, and oddly the cab is real small on these uh, if I load up a picture which I'm not because they could be subject for copyright and you know YouTube on copyright because they're little annoying SOBs who try to get you for everything um, I'm sorry
thing under that? I think maybe we should stop. This is the electrical boxes, components, I don't know what you call them. But yeah, even the back here, trying to make it a little detailed. The weird thing about these is their um, headlights are by the, they're in the one by two instead of the two by one configuration. Kind of weird. So yeah, those are the three that I've been working on so far. Um, I worked on these about a week ago, and I haven't been able to work on any more since the stupid update glitch. So yeah, it's, let's see, it's been 10 minutes. I shouldn't go over the limit. Yeah, there's a little thing going on with that's the thing going on with the Roblox. They're just, <clears throat> they're doomed. The studio is doomed. They're, the people updating it are failing to realize all the issues that they are making. And they just agree that, they just agree with themselves that they shouldn't update it. Or they shouldn't fix it. Because they're ignorant. So, yeah, thanks for watching. Um. I'll probably post another video when this is fixed. Uh, or if they do add another glitch, I'll let all of you know. Uh, yeah, I'll see you in the next video. Bye.